Hi everyone, I'm Cindy with Protective Coating Company, also known as PC Products. Today we're going to do a video on how to use PC Petrifier on a rotted windowsill. This windowsill is from the 1800s at a farmhouse in Pennsylvania. It has a very rotted windowsill, it's very soft wood. So uh, we have a product called PC Petrifier that is uh, going to harden the wood. It is a single component, you don't have to mix two parts together, it's just one uh, component in a bottle. Um, so the first step in uh, restoring this old window sill is to scrape away some of the old paint and the rotted, uh, really loose areas of the wood on the window sill. So I scraped away most of the rotted wood that was very loose and the, the paint that was on top of it, as you can see here. Um, after I scraped away a big chunks of it, uh, this is what's left that we have left. I also used a brush to, to brush away any of the loose uh, wood chips that were in the windowsill. So the next step is that we're going to actually use the PC Petrifier and we're going to really saturate this rotted wood, wood. So I have a 16 ounce bottle here that I'm going to use on this windowsill. And as you can see, it's a very liquidy kind of milk looking uh, uh, product. And this is going to soak right into the wood. I'm going to also use this brush to, to make sure it gets right into all the wood. You can brush it around. And that is all soaked in. I'm actually going to apply a little bit more to make sure I'm fully saturated in this wood. Now this is going to take overnight to cure, especially in a hot sunny day. Actually may only take 12 hours, but we're going to give this overnight. And um, we're going to come back tomorrow and we're going to see how um, hardened this windowsill is. And then we'll be able to fill it in with our PC Woody. We have multiple different sizes of our PC Petrifier wood hardener. We have a 16 ounce size. We also have a smaller eight ounce size, which is half of this. And for very large projects and multiple window sills, we have our, our gallon size of the PC Petrifier. Hi, this is Cindy again with Protective Coating Company, also known as PC Products. Uh, here at an old window sill that we hardened with our wood hardener called PC Petrifier. And this has fully cured now. Um, as you can see, this wood is nice and hard now as compared to the soft, squishy wood over here on this side. We didn't actually repair this side of the windowsill, so we can have a comparison so that you can see the finished side versus the non-finished side. So um, what we're going to do here now, so we have a big void in our windowsill. We need to fill that void with a product called PC Woody, which is a two-part wood epoxy paste. Um, comes in multiple different sizes. We have the large gallon size. We have a um, a half gallon size, a 12 ounce, 6 ounce, and tiny little small project sizes. Um, so the PC Woody is a, uh, it's a two part wood epoxy. Uh, the key to, for PC Woody is you actually have to mix equal amounts of each side. We have an A and a B side, you have to mix equal amounts. So I'm going to take some out of the A side and the B side and I'll mix it together and show you how you can actually mix the PC Woody together. And this is a real thick peanut butter type consistency, um, which is nice because you can work vertically. Oh, another little trick here. Before you dip this into the other side, you always want to wipe it off because then you're going to start the uh, hardening process. So make sure you clean off your tools before you go from A to B. 50-50 uh, mix. I'm going to try to grab about the same amount on the other side. It uh, doesn't have to be exact, you just want to be able to eyeball it, make sure that you have about the same amount on, on each side. So now we're going to start mixing up the PC Woody. You have about 30 minutes of work time once you start mixing up the PC Woody. And after you apply it, it will cure in about 12 to 24 hours. So you let it sit overnight, it'll cure. 
and it'll harden up. Uh, this actually, the PC Woody actually has some wood flower built into it, so it's really nice and flexible. It'll bend with the wood. Uh, this can be used on structural wood, indoors, outdoors. After it's cured, it's also fully waterproof. So here's some of my tricks for mixing. You just kind of scrape the bottom. Whoop. And blend it all in together. I'm gonna mix for about a minute. Is there anything else you guys want me to say? Okay, so our PC Woody is fully mixed. I mixed the two sides together for about a minute. I'm gonna use this putty knife over here and you can see this is a real thick epoxy and I can go vertical if I had a repair that was a vertical repair this would uh, be real easy to just adhere vertically and it's not going to drip or sag so here's our void in our windowsill I'm just going to go ahead and start pressing in the, the PC woody like we need more okay so we're I, I use the rest of the PC Woody to fill in all the voids here and uh, a trick that we use is that you can use denatured alcohol to smooth out the PC Woody once it's still um, workable so I have denatured alcohol here in this jug and I'm actually just gonna pour it right over top of the PC Woody uh, you can use gloves but I'm just gonna I'm just gonna use my finger to smooth out the PC Woody with the denatured alcohol just right on top of it. This is so that we have less sanding to do when we come back to sand it. So after this is all cured, we're gonna come back and sand it and you can uh, paint over it, you can drill into it, you can nail into it, anything that you would do with wood. You can, this is what um, you can do with PC Woody. So you can see how nice and smooth this is, this is now. It's all smoothed out. we waited overnight for the PC Woody to fully cure and dry and as you can see this is really hard now and um, so the next step is to like any project you would want to sand it down and then we're gonna paint it so I brought a uh, an electric sander here and we're gonna we're just gonna go through and uh, sand up get rid of some of the extra bumps here of the PC Woody <laughs> As you can see, it looks like wood. It, it flakes off, it's gonna sand real nice. Okay, I'm also gonna touch up some of the last minute spots here with a hand sander. And once you're done sanding, the best way to clean it off is you can use some of this denatured alcohol and just wipe it down before you paint it. Uh, we also use the denatured alcohol to clean off our tools with the PC Woody. It takes the, the epoxy right off the tools real nice. All right, I'm just cleaning this down a little bit and we are ready to, to paint. I have an exterior paint that we're gonna use and there's primer built into it. So you only need to use one coat. So once this dries, our window will be uh, restored. That hardwood is uh, hardened and we have filled everything in with our PC Woody.